In the first problem of section 3.7, we're asked to find the mass of a rectangular prism that's um, sitting in three-dimensional space uh, with a given density function of, um, of, hyper of the hyperbolic cosine of z for each cross-section in the xy plane. So we're assuming for each, each time we cut across the xy plane, parallel to the xy plane, that the density um, is constant in that. Uh, in that section. So the solid that we're trying to find the mass of is going to look something like this. So what we want to do is we want to take a uh, cross-section of, um, take each, each cross-section, find the, uh, add a little bit infinitesimal thickness, find the density uh, at that section, and then multiply it by uh, the area. So the area of any, each cross-section is, well, each cross-section is just a square parallel to the xy plane, or uh, excuse me, a rectangle with one side length 3 and the other side length uh, 6. So the area of any cross section at z is just constant at 18. So the mass is going to be equal to the integral that we want to integrate from z equals 0 to 5 of the area, 18, times the density function. So 18 cosh of z, dz, and that's equal to 18 cinch of z, evaluated from 0 to 5, which is just equal to 18 uh, cinch of 5, which if you evaluate that, it's about 1,335.66.